All right, what's going on YouTube? Um, so I'm gonna be faceless for the rest of the video so you can see what I'm playing, but I'm gonna teach you how to play one after 909 by the Beatles. So here we go. All right, so the first chord is gonna be a B7. It's a second finger, second string, first finger, finger, first finger over here, third finger on the G string, second fret, and fourth finger on the, the high E, second fret. That's your B7, he's gonna hang on that for a while. Get to the move over once. So the next one is the E minor seven. I believe it's E minor seven. It's just a normal E. Maybe it's just an E seven. So that's how you do that. So E, E minor, E major. E major 7, I guess. That's the second chord. So he's going to be two over once. Then he goes back to the B7. Then he goes to F7. That's where he says 1 after 909. So then he goes back to the B7. So uh, the F7 is just uh, it's like a normal power chord here. But you could be barring the whole thing down and then adding the G uh, string, second fret, or second finger. That's your F7. So the whole part, after hang on to this for a while. The only other part is the next part. We're just gonna start off on that E uh, major seven. So we're gonna pick up my bags. Goes back to the B7. He's gonna go C sharp seven. So let's show you that chord. It's just a normal, like if you're playing a C. You're gonna slide it up a fret, and then use the uh, your pinky guy there on the G uh, G string on the fourth fret. So, easy way to remember it. Uh, so we'll start that part again. Go to the F7 right after that, so just leave this guy there and then so all the way through.
that is the lesson. Uh, hit subscribe if you would, or that like button always helps. And uh, got a lot of other videos on my channel if you guys want to check them out. Thanks for watching. Catch you next time. Peace.